What's going on beautiful people? My name of course is iLogix HD. Welcome to the channel. If you're new here, today we're going to be playing a brand new game called NBA Now 22. If you've been rocking with me for a while, you know I play NBA 2K Mobile, I play NBA Live Mobile, I play the 2K games on console, and obviously at the moment we haven't got an EA well, counterpart, I guess. So, anyway, long story short, I play a lot of NBA games, so I'm trying out this new one to see what's happening in terms of it. We did play another one recently, I think it was called Ball Stars in the end. I think that was the name of it. And uh, yeah, we had a good time on that. So it's an exciting one to see whether this is going to be any good. It's just literally released. So without further ado, let's jump into it. If you're new to the channel, I do recommend subscribing if you want to see more content like this and you want to see more NBA mobile content indeed. Um, yeah, it's an interesting one. I think this one's officially licensed by the NBA and obviously it's released for tip-off. Um, I did stay up for the Lakers game. It went okay, but obviously we didn't win, so I don't know. I think from the top of my head, it was seven points lost, right? So it wasn't too bad, but hey, it is what it is. We really threw it away in the last uh, the last quarter, but what can you do? Anyway, so select a leader. I'm going to go with Mr. LeBron James, there's no doubt about it. Um, looking pretty nice. He's been upgraded to a 79 straight away. Okay, nice. And we've got the Lakers team, a new team founded. So... Let's see. Now, I do believe the controls are slightly different, and it is actually a portrait game instead of landscape, so that's an interesting one to take note of. I mean, that's pretty much easier for when you're on the go, I guess. But, uh, yeah, I, I don't know. I don't know if this one's going to be amazing, whether it's going to be, you know, okay, but I'm going to try to give you my honest opinion and do some gameplay in the meantime. So, here we go. NBA Now 22. The 22 has got a bit of a Raptors feel to it. Is it just me to think that? Move around the, move around the pad to move the player. Uh, it's indicated area. Okay, so that's how we're going to be doing that, right? Once again, move the player to... Okay, right. Uh, swipe the pad to pass. Okay, nice. And then go like that. So it's left to right, left to right. And then to shoot, we've got to tap and hold. Hmm. I mean, I'm tapping. He doesn't want to do it. Huh. I mean, huh, okay, that's going to take some getting used to, to be honest. Um, it's it's very much, you need to really press down on it. Tap the pad quickly to twice to penetrate the player. Okay, and then you can drive forward for the shot. Okay, that's going to take some, uh, I, I don't know, I feel like that's a little bit too heavy. Tap the center of the pad to perform automatic defense. Yeah, you've got to really press down. Um, it depends if you've got a phone cover on. So if you've got a screen cover on, you're probably going to have a bit of a bit of a one there, a bit of an issue. But uh, yeah, look, proper after try and move that across there. Okay, that's interesting. Might need to try and mess up, mess around with the haptics there. I think that's what it is. Haptics, haptics. No. Um, but yeah, that's that's uh, that's an interesting one. It's causing me mad issues to try and, you know. Yeah, look, look, look how hard it is to try and steal. Okay, that, look. I don't know how I feel about that. It seems like it's a bit of a heavy touch. I don't know if it's just for me or if it's for everyone, but that's a thing to, uh, to know. There you go. So, successful block there. Okay, interesting. I think certainly something that needs to be sorted, maybe, for me at least. Um, if you have a screen case on or a screen cover, eh. A screen protector, I mean, then that's maybe how you can have a situation there. But nevertheless, let's see what we can do here. So, select rookie one for difficulty, no problem at all. You're gonna get begin the postseason after for 82 games. You can play a full league, okay? Cool. I'm interested to see what content this game's got. So let's see. Let's play this one anyway. I really think we're gonna be in trouble because of the uh, the tap issue. But let's see. Dragic, 81 overall, okay. That's fine. I think this is going to be a bit of an interesting result. So let's see. Let's see what we can do. Come on. I'm liking it. I'm liking the little intro so far. It's looking pretty nice on the graphics. Uh, you can actually auto it, but you can play for three minutes. Interesting that you can pick your option on how to do it. I like that you've got the ability to auto it. I really do. You can change the control type. Okay. Can we do that? Let's go with B. Yes, now now we're talking. Now now we're cooking on gas, people. I like that you can change that. That is very nice to see. Oh, was that a little graphic there? Oh, very nice. I like that a lot. Okay. So. Really got to get used to this. This is um an interesting one. Oh, look, we've got the steel. Lovely. 
I've missed that. Oh no, I've given it a bucket. Okay, cool. Three point all day, baby. I think it's going to take a little while getting used to it. The controls are a little bit different. Um, certainly if you played like NBA Live Mobile or NBA 2K Mobile, it's very much... Um, I mean, I think the fact that it's a portrait sort of game into the landscape kind of throws you out in terms of it, but I certainly prefer this control system to the to the single pad one. I think I'm, I'm more of a classic sort of control man. Like, it's not, it's not that sort of, you know, it has to be crazy. He did get the dunk there, to be fair, didn't he? Okay, cool. So, so far, so good. Let's see if we can hit some more stuff here. I hope so. I hope so. AD? Is AD going to be able to pop that shot? They might need to slow it down with the old... Um, oh, look, there you go. Nice. And the only problem is, as well, you get your game missions, which cover sometimes the result of your shots there. Like, I mean, we went in for that dunk then. It was a nice animation of LeBron James, obviously, going for the dunk, but... You couldn't really see it. Oh, look, there's a nice one. See, that's cool. I'm liking it. It's not bad in the graphics. It's slightly clunky, I think that's the way to describe it. But I think these things can be edited out. Um, it's it's mainly down to... I think it's just mainly down to simple bug fixes, I, I, I'd i like to say. But so far, so good. I'm enjoying it. I would like to see what happens if I change the camera type a little bit. Let's, uh, let's try and do that. Can we change the camera type? We should be able to, no? Oh, you can push inwards. So that's further away. That's closer up. Okay. And what does this button do? Ah, oh, you can make subs. Oh, that's pretty cool. Okay. And we go for the shot. No, no good. I think it's that. It's that little uh, moment there. If you miss a shot and you need to try and get the ball back quickly before they go on the break... Um, it just sort of does a little bit of clunkiness with the camera mechanics, but I think that can be uh, pretty much breezed out And I don't think that's too much of an issue at all. So so far so good. Let's see what we can do still Defensive foul. Okay, so you can get defensive fouls in it as well. That's good to see. I not all mobile games really do that sort of stuff um, So yeah, it's a bit like a handball in football. No like on mobile games for football. You don't really get that um, I'm talking about soccer, if you're if you're thinking American football. Obviously, you can use your hands in American football, but you know what I mean. Anyway, let's throw that forward, see what we can do. I think we're going to get this dub. Ah, see, that was a bad pass by me. But yeah, you can see the sort of camera. I'm going to click the double. What happens if we do the double? Ah, unlucky. Unlucky. So... Yeah, I think this is pretty good. Um, I'm interested to see what the rest of the content is in this game. So once we finish this, we should be able to clear that up. But so, I, I mean, it's worth trying out, you know. Um, hey, look. So we need to score how many more three pointers? A few more, to say the least. But so I don't know. I don't know what you get for obviously completing these missions yet. That's all new to me. But I'm sure we'll find out. I shouldn't have let him shoot that, but it's absolutely fine. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. I've just realised as well. It's ironic that we get the Golden State Warriors as our uh, as our tutorial game, as that's who we played last night. I'm assuming they've linked up the NBA schedule for at least the uh, well the main season, right? Um, to the player, to the team that you pick, unless it was completely by chance and it was a fluke that we ended up getting the Golden State Warriors. I don't know. Cheeky little buzzer beater option there as well. Quarter end rewards. We get a basic player pack. Okay, I like that. Uh, you can exit the game by tapping the leave button. Save and leave. Okay, that's interesting. So you have the option to walk away from it and come back when you feel like it. I like that. That's a cool, cool little situation there. So let's go back to the home and then mission. Here we go. This will be good. Change the lineup. That's something they want to do. Guide missions are the easiest for those who are new to the game. Uh, so you sort of your fatui or you work through missions conveniently with a go feature. Uh, learn how to play NBA following the guide missions and enjoy various stuff. Okay, so we've done the tutorial there. That's nice. I don't think there's anything else I can pick up. Um, what's this? You can move the next menu by swiping the screen left to right. Left to right. Da -da 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 -da, you know, um, pretty, pretty cool. Okay, so if I wanted to go back, uh, we've got an event. More info. This is loaded very weird. Um, lots of rewards to develop your team. Opening web event, season opening event, and yeah, okay, pretty cool. Um, open up a gift box every day. So we actually get a gift box as well. Um, 
cool. So, complete daily missions and own gift boxes. So check the event page, that was one of them. Rewards sent, check your inbox. I feel like this could be changed up a little bit to be more um, user friendly. I don't know, it just doesn't seem finished. I, I think, but hey, look, again, it's early days and it's a brand new app. I can't really say much because these are the expectations. Um, today's rewards, you've, wow, that's a lot of rewards. Okay, I like that. Um, what can we do? What's this pack? A gold player pack. Okay. We haven't got any of them right now, obviously. Um, you've got a recommended package that you can do. See all your starter packages there. I'll leave that for now. I'm not going to be buying anything as of yet. Um, let's have a look, though. What have we got? So, we've got some additional rewards there. You can watch ads. So, you can watch ads to get some stuff. Checking event, storage period. We get a... Okay. We've got a lot coming through here. And I need to see what I can do. Pre-registration reward, I like that. Pre-registration reward, see I'm really happy to see that sort of stuff there. I could have collected the uh, collect all button at the bottom there, I didn't see that until we got there, but either way, very cool. So, premium position selective, um, yeah, you can get vintage primes. I like the packs though. The packs have got this really old school feel, I like that a lot. Um, we get a Burke, okay. So nothing too flashy. Basic player, it's gonna be at least a silver. Well, it's just probably going to be a silver, no? What do we get? Teague. Okay. And finally. Martin. Okay. Not bad. Material. We've got some recovery cards. We've got pre-registration reward, which I want to use. What does it get me? Oh, Joe Embiid. Golden Lucky Coupon. Okay. You can earn up to... Really? That's very cool. Swipe the screen and check the prize, mate. Aye, it's like a little scratcher. That's insane. 6,600 coins there. That's not bad at all. We take those. Gold consumable box. We're opening it up as well. There's a lot of different content in here. I'm very surprised. So, let's take that Joel and Bead. You can obtain a Joel and Bead gold live player card. So, we don't know what the rate... 89 Joel and Bead. That's insanity. Okay, very cool. We can change the team name as well. I'm not going to do that right this moment um, because we don't really need to. We do have some packs as well. Let's use all. Silver to diamond. So you can get diamond players in here. Let's see what happens when we open. Oh, hello. Silver, silver, silver. But I mean, they're not bad ratings either, to be honest. And in this one, we get a player pack. I'm saying silver to diamond player from a selected conference when used. Okay. I'm just going to go Eastern Conference. I don't really think it matters too much, but... Let's see what we get. Let's see what we get. Smith. Okay. From the Pistons. Nice. And I think that's what we've got right now. So the question is, if I was to go to, I'm assuming the store is hiding. Is the store hiding? There's an arcade mode, league mode, battle mode, manage team. Draft. There's a draft. That's very cool. I want to see this draft in a second. Um, yes. So these are all the actual ones you pay with. Are they all pay with? Okay, you can actually buy packs this way. Interesting. You can buy these lucky coupons as well. That's really cool. I like to see that. Um, here we go. So, we do one of one. We've got no of none of these, right? Um, so, how do we switch to get the stars? You've got to do that. Why that is. Okay. So, we can actually get coins purchases with that. Um Let's see, mileage, no, package. They're all money related, I assume. I can't see any coin packs, so I'm interested to see what these silver coins do in comparison to the gold. Um, it's nice to see you've got the 75 logo at the bottom there as well, that's pretty cool. And the attendance as well. So that's your daily login. Okay, and the draft, the draft seems like an interesting process. Sorry, like I'm literally just rambling at this point. Oh, hello, okay. Now we might be finding what we need to find. So, this is where the store's lurking. You get a free daily pack. Rate. I don't want to rate it. Wait, what, what do you mean rate? That's very strange. Does it mean like the, the pull rate or what? Okay. Really, really, really. Eh? We've got an ad pack there that now replaces it. We can get... We can't get that. But let's, let's see. What happens if we open up one of these? A basic player pack. Here we go. Basic 
player pack. 76 Andre Drummond. That's not a bad pull. I'll do one more and I think we'll wrap this video up. If you enjoyed today and you want to see more content on this game, then let me know down in the comments below. Pick it up. It's actually free to download in the store. It's worth trying out. If it's not your cup of tea, it's not your cup of tea. If you think that you enjoy the other games a little bit more, then go for it. But I generally came into this with an open mind and so far it's pretty cool. Um, you can sign up. You can sign up for players. Look, honestly, there is a lot of content here. You can enter auctions for players as well. Very, very cool. Is That's just, yeah, that's crazy. I want that Russell. Um, you can bid. Oh, okay. So you can actually, yeah, you can bid on stuff as well. It's nice. I like this. Um, I'm excited to see what else happens. So, yeah. I think that's about as far as it goes here. We can grade cards as well, which is pretty nice. Um, but, yeah, overall, super happy. Anyway. Might do some more. Let me know down in the comments below. But anyway, appreciate you for rocking with me. If you're new to the channel, subscribe, leave a like, comment for down below and all that good stuff. Love to your family. Stay safe, stay healthy. Tata, adios. Bye-bye.